So let's continue from where we stopped. If you find this to be informative, please remember to subscribe, like, and uh, leave me a comment if you have challenges. So now I want to see what happens when we click on the button. I want to see something happen here. Uh, this is called login, okay? So it's called login. But normally in functional programming, login is not uh, actually uh, taken uh, as something very important because it's side effect, which is uh, not so desirable in functional programming. But now let's see how we can actually log something on the console when we click uh, on the button. All right, so I did some explanation here. So to be able to log, we need to import uh, the bug from, we need to import the bug. And uh, we have log, which is part of the debug um, package. So I'm going to say debug from import debug exposing log. Okay. So this is going to help us to log. So now what is going to happen is when something updates, when something updates, when there might be a click of a button or something, we want to log something to the console. And how do we do this? We use let clause. So we have let and in so in between let and in we can actually log anything we want to log to the console uh by writing it here so i'm going to say log uh log message log message one is equal to log and then specify key value so let's say log one and let's say button was clicked Button was clicked, and, and the next one I'm gonna say log message two. Maybe I'm just gonna copy this one across and just copy this and paste it here as well. Okay, all right. So we have messages I want to log to the console when the button was clicked, and when the model updates, um, we are going to have this message log. So everything we want to do in the console that does not have anything to do with it what page we can just do it here so this is gonna be log two button was clicked again all right so this is how to log to the console so what's gonna happen is this message is gonna be displayed in the console when an update occurs when a button click is clicked so what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna uh, run this up uh, i'm gonna recompile this first i'm gonna save everything and I'm gonna come here, stop this, and then say M make M make main dot M. I can't even. Okay, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. So it gives error. So why is this error? Take note that we are following the instruction here. So it says um, let the expression define log message one. Ah, okay, so this is quite quiet. So, okay, great. So let's go back here and make, and that's, that's fine. And I'm going to start my M reactor, M reactor. Okay, perfect. So if I go back here now, I'm going to refresh this page. Now, if I update, let's say click on a button, you can see that there's a message logged on the console. If I click again, it's logged. So what we can see from here is that our button is working perfectly well and it logs to the console. So the next thing we want to talk about now and the next part, we are going to be talking about updating the model with a button click. Because now we have this uh, log to the console, but we want to actually update the model. And what's the model? The model is these two items. We want to update this on, on button click, and then we talk about uh, rendering the updated model to the, uh, to the UI. So I'm going to be stopping here. Please remember to subscribe to my channel, and also please leave me a comment if this has been informative for you.